The beauty of IPD project and, and why the Knight Cancer Institute was so interested in using it is because it, it really is like a mirror to how we want to work within the building. As the owner, we're, we're going for um, optimizing the whole. And in order to do that, we really believe that you need everybody working together as a team from the very beginning of the project. Having the contractor on our team enables us to look at systems in a different way. It enables us to find ways to solve problems that we cannot do on our own. IPD is really an incredible opportunity that brings the owner so much more than the traditional model would have otherwise brought. So there's just so much value there. I can't, can't tell you enough how, how important it is. The thing that's really important about integrated project delivery is that it's all about behavior and it's not just about tools. It's really all about integrating all of the members of the team, the owner, the architect, the contractor, and the trade partners, so that the project is served and everyone has an interest in the project. We try to be very open about our thought process. We try to make sure to push people past their limits a little bit farther than they're comfortable with. That really enabled an open environment, a transparency that no other project I've been on has ever seen. You have to be comfortable being uncomfortable. When you push yourself to do that, things come out of it that you don't typically see. It's a continual process of getting people acclimated to the culture and getting them bought into the culture and continuing to drive forward with, with the things that we're doing. The relationships that you build here, just by being in the same room with people you're not normally in the same room with, it helps to leverage the trust that you need to develop to, to, to really act as a good cohesive team. It's, it, it helps with immediate answers to questions. It helps with uh, getting people's input that you wouldn't normally get on, on a design issue or a con contracting issue or a construction issue. It, it's bringing people to the table that normally aren't included. When people get on board in that kind of a program, they take ownership of it. The beauty of this team is that we have totally empowered everybody on every team to speak up and provide what they have to offer. Not just sit back and say, oh, I've got a better idea, but I'm not in charge, so I'm not going to say anything, but instead to really say, I could add to that, and to have the confidence to step up and do that. It gives the owner a better project. The owner embeds with us as designers, and we can then design the exact project that the owner needs. I've been really lucky. I've worked on some other projects that were what I would call very collaborative in nature. Never have I had access to the, the trade partners and the subcontractors so early in the process and, and with so much great input. I think it just builds a, a, a better team and helps everybody focus on what the, the main goal is, which is a great building. Once we got uh, into the project, we realized we were in for a great journey. Uh, the energy of the team was at such a high level because not only were we uh, solving challenges uh, like we would normally internally, we were doing it as a team. The bottom line is we really trust each other to do the work we needed to and then we made sure that we worked together to get it done. Portland is making efforts to become probably one of the centers of cancer research. So I think having this facility of this size and magnitude dedicated to that research, and specifically around early detection, which is so critical to cancer research, is gonna be amazing for the city of Portland.